Picture this, it's the late 1960s, a time of psychedelic swirls, bell bottoms, and groovy tunes. The airwaves are buzzing with a new sensation, a show that's about to captivate hearts across the nation. It's none other than Love, American Style, a TV series that became a time capsule of its era, a vibrant expression of love and life in all its technicolor glory. For those fortunate souls who caught a glimpse of this show during its heyday, memories are etched in the mind like cherished Polaroid snapshots. Maybe it was the catchy theme song that made your heart skip a beat, or the charmingly wacky characters who seemed like they stepped straight out of a kaleidoscope. And oh, those stories, many romantic comedies that left you alternately giggling and swooning. Was it a quirky courtship that had you grinning ear to ear? Or perhaps a hilariously mischievous escapade that left you doubled over with laughter? Love, in all its forms, played out on the screen, first dates, long-term relationships, and everything in between. It was a buffet of emotions, wrapped up in technicolor nostalgia. But let's not keep you waiting any longer. As we journey back to that magical era, let's uncover some hidden gems about the show that might just surprise you. Did you know that the show's iconic theme song had a fascinating journey of its own? And there's a juicy tidbit about the guest stars that's bound to raise an eyebrow or two. So buckle up, dear reader, as we delve into the heartwarming, rib-tickling world of love, American style. Hit ready to reminisce, chuckle, and maybe even shed a tear for those bygone days of television wonder. And now, without further ado, let's uncover the fascinating facts that make this show a true classic. Hold on to your vintage hats. Here come the random facts that will make you see love, American style, in a whole new light. Love, American Style, the beloved TV series that captured the hearts of viewers in 1969 boasted a cast of rotating guest stars, a veritable who's who of well-known actors and actresses. These charismatic guest appearances were a cornerstone of the show's allure, drawing audiences in with each fresh face and unique storyline. However, beneath the glitz and glamour of the showbiz world, a fascinating secret lay hidden. The credits for many of the show's humorous blackouts, those delightful comedic interludes, bore the enigmatic names of Semiro Mitsubai and Tawasaki Kwai. Curiously, these names were nothing but pseudonyms, as revealed in the memoir My Happy Days in Hollywood. The masterminds behind these witty moments were none other than Gary Marshall, the memoir's author, and his longtime writing collaborator Jerry Belson. Their creative partnership, veiled behind these clever aliases, added an extra layer of intrigue to the show's legacy. As the curtain closed on each episode, it was the harmony among the cast and crew that truly resonated. While tales of onset disagreements occasionally surfaced, the prevailing atmosphere was one of camaraderie and positivity. This cohesive synergy behind the scenes undoubtedly contributed to the genuine on-screen chemistry that audiences adored. Love, American style not only served up tales of romance and comedy, but also wove a web of Hollywood intrigue. Its star-studded guest roster, masked creativity, and harmonious working environment made it a standout in the television landscape of its time. As the years roll on, the show's legacy remains a testament to the magic that happens when talent and teamwork intertwine. Love, American Style, a glimpse into changing societal norms, the 1969 TV series Love, American Style remains etched in the cultural landscape as a quintessential reflection of shifting societal norms during the 1970s. Though it debuted in the late 1960s, its resonance with the ensuing decade's changes is unmistakable. This anthology series, celebrated for its light-hearted take on love, and relationships garnered attention for more than its on-screen content. Notably, the show found an unexpected major sponsor in Oscar Mayer, the renowned purveyor of meats. The marriage of romantic vignettes and hot dogs might appear unusual, but this collaboration secured the show's financial stability and allowed it to flourish. One intriguing crossroads of love, American style lies in its musical ties. The television singers responsible for rendering its catchy theme song were also the vocal talents behind the opening tune of That Girl, another popular show of the era. This synchrony of musical contributions added a harmonious layer to the television landscape. While the series charmed audiences with tales of romance, comedy, and often a blend of both, its larger significance is often associated with the cultural sea change of the 1970s. It emerged as a precursor, setting the stage for the explorations of love, relationships, and societal dynamics that would come to define the following decade. 
In retrospect, Love, American Style Serves is more than just a television show. It encapsulates a pivotal moment when the nation grappled with evolving ideals and perspectives. The series, which began in the late 1960s, ultimately found its place as a touchstone for the cultural landscape of the 1970s. Controversial themes and musical harmony, unveiling intriguing aspects of the 1969 TV series Love. American Style The Year 1969 marked the debut of the beloved TV series Love, American Style, a cultural touchstone that blended romantic narratives with comedic vignettes. While the show's iconic status is well known, a closer examination reveals fascinating insights that continue to pique interest. One particular facet that captivated viewers was the recurrent appearance of a large, brass bed, a motif that paid homage to the avant-garde classic The Bed. In a nod to James Broughton's experimental masterpiece, The Bed, the series incorporated a similar brass bed in every story and interstitial blackout vignette. Broaden's 1967 short film, Capturing the Free Spirit of the Summer of Love in San Francisco, featured nude individuals frolicking on a brass bed within a garden setting. This influence on love, American style evoked the daring essence of Broaden's work, aligning with the series' penchant for unconventional narratives. Beyond its aesthetic nods, love, American style courageously tackled controversial subjects, propelling it beyond typical romantic fare. Episodes unflinchingly delved into social issues and unconventional relationships, sparking conversations that reverberated far beyond the screen. These thought-provoking storylines ignited debates and showcased television's potential to mirror and influence societal norms. Notably, the show's musical landscape played a harmonious role in its success. In its inaugural season, the theme song resonated with audiences courtesy of The Cousels, a popular family musical group. However, the musical baton was later passed to the Charles Fox Singers, a cohort of accomplished Los Angeles studio musicians renowned for their work on radio and television commercials. This transition upheld the show's melodic appeal while underscoring its adaptability. Love, American Style endures as an emblem of its era, celebrated for its boundary-pushing narratives and melodic charm. Beyond its romantic veneer, the series dared to explore the unconventional and dared to question societal norms, leaving an indelible mark on the television landscape. Intriguing facets converge in the story of love, American style, where the echoes of experimental art, controversial themes, and musical metamorphosis create a mosaic of cultural resonance. The 1969 TV series Love, American Style brought a unique blend of romance and comedy to households across the nation. With its anthology format, the show presented a collection of lighthearted, standalone stories that delved into the various facets of love and relationships. Each episode, running for about 30 minutes, showcased a different romantic tale, offering viewers a diverse array of narratives that ranged from sweet to humorous. However, what truly set this series apart was its impact on the television landscape. Love, American Style not only entertained audiences, but also paved the way for future successes. The show spawned a successful spin-off series, Happy Days, which went on to become one of the most beloved sitcoms in television history. Happy Days introduced iconic characters like Arthur Fonzie Fonzarelli and captured the essence of the 1950s and 60 Seconds Americana, creating a cultural phenomenon that resonates even today. Remarkably, love, American style holds a distinct accolade. As of 2020, it was one of only four television shows that lasted an hour long and featured a laugh track. This unique combination of format and style contributed to the show's signature rhythm, making it a standout in the television landscape of its time. While the years have passed and television has evolved, the legacy of love, American style endures. The show's innovative approach to storytelling, its role in spawning a cherished spin-off, and its status as a notable hour-long program with a laugh track all contribute to its place in television history. Love, American Style, a launch pad for Happy Days stars the beloved 1969 TV series, Love, American Style, known for its lighthearted take on romantic tales, unknowingly set the stage for one of television's most iconic shows. Love, American Style not only captured the hearts of viewers, but also provided the launching pad for what would become the hit series Happy Days. In a serendipitous turn of events, the episodes titled Love 
and the happy days and love and the newscasters showcased a trio of talented actors who would later become central figures in the beloved sitcom Happy Days. Ron Howard, Anson Williams, and Marion Ross, all eventual cast members of Happy Days, made their early appearances on Love, American Style. Little did they know that these initial roles would lead them to stardom in the nostalgic world of 1950s and 1960s nostalgia. This unexpected connection between the two series lent happy days and authentic camaraderie among its cast members, whose chemistry had already been tested on the stage of love, American style. The seamless transition from one show to another not only showcased their versatile acting skills, but also solidified their places in television history. The links between the two series extend beyond just the cast. The tone and spirit of love, American style resonated with audiences, creating a receptive environment for the soon-to-be-launched Happy Days. The light-hearted, family-friendly humor that defined both shows became a hallmark of 1970s television, providing audiences with a nostalgic escape during a time of societal change. So, the next time you settle in for a classic episode of Happy Days, remember that the journey to 1950s nostalgia began with the romantic escapades of love, American style. The unexpected fusion of love and laughter set the stage for a television legacy that continues to capture hearts to this day. As we bid adieu to the vivid tapestry that is love, American style, let your thoughts linger on the remarkable journey it has taken you on. Through its vignettes of love's myriad forms, it has undoubtedly touched chords within your heart, resonating with the very essence of your own experiences. The series is not just a collection of stories, it's a mirror reflecting your own connections, emotions, and memories. As you've navigated the intricate paths of romance, humor, and life showcased on the screen, you might find yourself reminiscing about instances that made you laugh out loud moments that tugged at your heartstrings, or characters that felt like old friends. It's in these reflections that love, American style, becomes more than just a show. It transforms into a part of your personal narrative, a vessel carrying your emotions and dreams. Now, as you take a moment to contemplate the impact of this iconic series, we invite you to share your treasured memories, the fragments of stories that have stayed with you through the years. Your voice adds to the chorus of sentiments, weaving together a collective tapestry of nostalgia and appreciation for the beauty of human connections portrayed on screen. In closing, we extend our heartfelt gratitude for joining us in this exploration of love, American style. Your time and interest have been invaluable, enriching the legacy of a show that has left an indelible mark on the annals of television history. So, let your thoughts flow, your memories resurface, and your heart swell as you recall the moments that made you laugh, cry, and believe in the magic of love. Share your thoughts and stories, and let the spirit of love, American style, continue to thrive. Warm regards.